really excited that you're here today and joining me to share in this formula that I've got and I've used and replicated time and time again in very different areas of my life as my formula for success. I can tell you, if you follow this eight step process, it will be a surefire way that you'll achieve the life that you've desired, you've lived a passionate life, and you've been on purpose the whole way through. And most of all, you have some fun. So let's get into it. Step number one is to have passion. And what I mean by passion is not just showing up and doing a job. Don't do things for money. You do things because you love them. And as a result, I can guarantee you'll be paid very handsomely for what you do. Step two, nothing beats work hard. No one ever achieves success just by rolling out of bed and falling into success. They worked hard and very deliberately at their craft and they perfected it. Point three is be good. Be good at what you do and be great at what you do and practice, practice, practice. You might be starting at the bottom, but if you continue to practice and strive for perfection, you will achieve great success. Point number four, favorite of mine, focus. Focus with laser-like attention. Hone in on one thing and do it incredibly well and become known for it and great at it. Don't let your mind stray. Pick one task, finish it, and then move on to the next. Point five is push yourself. Push yourself physically, mentally, and emotionally. And when you're tired, push through self-doubt because we all have that little voice in the back of our mind that says, you can't really do it or it's not possible. And what I need you to do at that time is to step up and say, thanks for sharing, but it is, and I can, and I will. Point six, if you wanna increase your level of happiness, give, serve others. The minute that you serve others and deliver and give value is the time that you're open to receive. Number seven is ideas. Listen, observe, be curious. Find that inner child in you. I got a little boy who's eight and he asks why for everything because he wants to know, he's curious. But as we get older, we lose that ability. What I want you to do is find that little eight year old in you and ask questions, explore. Don't be afraid to test the water and don't be afraid to fail. The greatest learnings and lessons I've had in life have been from my failures, not my successes. Most of all, problem solve and make connections. And here's the last one which ties it all together, persist. If you can persist through your failures, success is just around the corner. And I'm gonna go out on a bit of a limb here and say something probably a little bit crazy. Persist through the crap. And crap is an acronym for me, which is persist through the criticism. As I always say, those that say it can't be done should get out of the way of those already doing it. The second one is rejection. Persist through antagonists. People are gonna come against you. People are gonna make some noise about what you're doing. Be a maverick, get out there and break new ground and ignore the naysayers. And finally, persist through pressure because at the end of pressure is the reward. And no great achievement has ever been realized without a little bit of pressure being applied. So hand on my heart, I can tell you, if you follow these eight steps, it is a proven formula that I and many others have used time and time again to achieve great success. Believe in your potential. I do, I'm Michael Cooper.